know how you make changes? By doing the things that you, you want to do. On TikTok, Oliver James is a personal trainer, aspiring motivational speaker. I'm here to motivate you. And an open book. I start with reading. Especially and I'm also when it comes to books. In my van, and I pretty much just said five words, what's up, I can't read. And that just started the whole entire journey on TikTok. Were you scared to share that with people? Oh, 100%. That was probably, if not at that time now, it was the scariest thing I could ever, ever even put out, I, I can say. Because when I finally was just like, no, this is it. Like, this is who you are. He, you know, whatever job comes with it, whatever friend, whatever relationship, whatever happens in your life, you have to deal with it because everyone's going to know exactly who you are. And it kind of was freeing. So now Oliver's learning to he, read. He'd have enough to get to the other shore of the straight, I think that word is. And he's sharing that sojourn, even the emotional moments, with his new friends online, the Book Talk community, racking up more than 130,000 followers and nearly a million likes. Honestly, it's sometimes some of the reasons why I get up every day. So even though I don't get paid for it or, you know, things I do, it feels like the best job in the entire world. Oliver is one of 8 million Americans who are functionally illiterate, which means he had some reading skills, but not enough to manage daily tasks at home or work. He realizes now his traumatic childhood is to blame. It was just, you know, a seed being planted in bad soil. My surroundings were like, you know, a little bit more chaotic and more in survival mode. Like I didn't have time to think about a book at all. Now Oliver's digging into the good soil, working out his body and mind. Life is full of ooh, ooh. <clears throat> Sometimes at the same time, all while motivating his followers. I didn't know I could help that many people with me just doing the one thing that was hard for me. The power of an open book. Thank you so much, books. You're amazing. I love y'all. <laughs> wow. Thank you, books. Mm. Oliver gave himself a rather colossal challenge to read 100 books this year. At last check, and we checked in with him yesterday, he's up to 15 already this year. And he is incredible, yeah. Joe. What a great story. And just the fact that he is so honest about his journey. It's not an easy journey. You see him in tears there. I love that he says it was liberating to share his story. I also love that the guy is doing like a 15-minute <laughs> yes. book. Right, doing a handstand yeah. while reading. Yeah. I'm like 12 yeah. seconds in. I'm like, oh, I think that was good. We're good. Yeah. We're good. We could all take a page from that book. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.